What's going on, sugar dumplings? It's Mo the Bearded Shark, Maine, but you already knew that. If you're new to my channel, well, thank you for stopping by and checking out my channel. Everybody that's existing, you know I love you and I appreciate you, so, you know, couldn't say it enough. Today, we're going to be talking about the newest scent that's actually dropping today for Crusher's Creations, and that is After Hours. You've seen it advertised on Instagram. You've seen people talk about it and all that, but unless you've been living under a rock, you know it ain't approved unless it's shark approved fool. <laughs> but um, Brian and Crystal did not actually ask me to make this video, but a lot of you have messaged me after you've seen my Instagram story and asked me what I thought about this scent profile. So, so I figured why not just make a video? When it comes to the after hours, it literally reminds me of what the name of it is, after hours. So after a long day of work, you know, it's time to relax, it's time, it's time to wind down, and you just pour you a glass of Jack Daniels honey and then light you up a nice vanilla flavored cigar, or I guess really not a vanilla flavored, but like a sweet tobacco cigar. That's the kind of smell I get out of it. And I'm telling you guys right now, like I love the smell and love the taste of honey. So the fact that there's honey in here, I was in love right off the bat. Um, Right off the bat, you get the mixture of honey and agar wood, which if you don't know what agar wood is, it is um, oud, but it's not the cologne type oud. It is the woodsy type oud. That's the scent I get up. Calm down over there, swag. I know, I know you heard oud, and now you're over there headbanging the wall saying you got to have it. You should order it, though. <laughs> but... It's a really nice, calming, soothing scent. Like, I kind of get like a little bit of a, like a black tea scent out of it, but I may be wrong. It's just that my shark senses are going off the wall. And he says in there, in the description, that he has little mystery sprinkles in there. So he may have like um, a black tea in there. But I get like, I get that nice, nice, sweet tobacco scent, like bourbon. Really get the agar wood and honey up front. But it, there's something in there, like maybe like a black tea or maybe like a little bit of a barbershop vibe to it, but I'm, I may be wrong. But it's such a relaxing, nice, nice scent. Like it's so smooth, like it's smooth. It's not like an alcoholic beverage kind of bourbon. It's just like it goes mixed together. It's like you accidentally dipped your cigar inside a glass of Jack Daniels honey. That's, I mean, literally that's how it is. Or it can be like you're just sitting there at a cigar bar. There's jazz music playing. It's dark. Everybody's just, you know, calm and laughing and relaxing. That's the kind of vibe you get. It's like, literally, it's not like disco inferno, like, you know, popping champagnes loud, or I guess you can say strong, like his normal sense, which is a normal sense, or strong, but they smell good. But this is like the opposite of what I'm used to from Crush's Creation. This is like a nighttime, night vibe scent, I guess you can say. But, uh, you know, that's the kind of scent profile that I get. So I, I absolutely enjoyed this scent, and this is definitely going to be something that will stay in my rotation because I love scents like this. I love calming and soothing scents. And he did a little bit something different. And I don't know if it's due to the COVID or, um, you know, he just wanted to do different bottles. But this, this comes with an eyedropper, which is normal uh, products come with like a restrictor on top, which I prefer the... <laughs> Uh, the droppers, but you know, it is what it is. It's not, so it's not something that's going to make me or break me or think differently about a product. I just prefer the droppers on here. So that was a nice surprise to see. That was a nice surprise to see. If you're like, all right, Mo, you've, you've explained enough. I don't want it. I don't like it. It's not my scent profile. That's fine. You can also pick up his fall fantasy. Now this one is straight up fall inside of a jar or inside of a bottle. It has apple cider, pear, and also a little bit of pumpkin spice in there. Now I, I smell mainly like fresh apple cider and pear. I don't get much pumpkin spice. So if you're not a big pumpkin guy, you're not gonna get a bunch of pumpkin in there. I do wanna brag about Crush's Creation. So you know, he's in North Carolina and to Georgia, that's a hot route. Like, you know, heat, heat, humidity and all this. And this is one of the few butters that make it and surviving. Like when people send butters to Georgia, I'm, I'm guaranteed they're like, 
oh my God, this is a death trap. It's going to get there and it's going to be melted. And it's going to be all messed up. But look at this. I did not use this butter on purpose because I wanted to show you guys. So look at that. It is literally perfect. Nothing wrong with it whatsoever. Just as creamy as anything else that he has. If you have not tried Crush's Creations, I definitely recommend you guys trying it. But it comes out so smooth. And this is his utility butter. But I mean, look at that. Like it's in hand. It's already melting without even me touching it. Look at that. Two swipes and it's done. Like it's he's got a really good good nourishing butter now i'm telling you guys this smell is so good now um the scent profile duration or the scent strength between the oil and the butter they're the same there's not one that's stronger than the other they're about they're even and in beard it lasted me a good six to seven hours at night time all right guys well that's it i hope this video helped figure out if you want to purchase after hours or not um it's going to be out again today later on i don't expect this one to make it more than a day before it sells out so if you want it i definitely recommend you guys going in there and add it to the cart as soon as that it comes available you can use code shark 10 it's not affiliate it's no kickback for me whatsoever again they had no idea i was making this video i just felt like i should for the people that have asked me about it um, you can use Shark 10 and you get 10% off. That's all I got for you guys today. So I'm going to get off here. I'm going to put some of this in my beard and get ready for bed. But I'll catch you guys on the next video. And as always, guys, stay bearded. Duh.